It is the Loose Cannons, another beautiful day out here at training camp, Steve. And, uh, you know, we, we just, we're just we watching this team start to come together. The pieces start to mesh and, and, and meld. And I look at this coaching staff, they're going to have some tough decisions coming up when they have to, unfortunately, whittle down and, and uh, you know, tell some players... Not this year. Well, we're sitting here with a guy that I'm really curious about going into the new season as we're being attacked again by that gigantic bug out here <laughs> at Charger Park. And that's defensive back Craig Mager is joining us once again, last year's third-round pick out of Texas State. First of all, Craig, thanks for stopping on by. Uh, you know, a year ago at this time, uh, a lot of people were still trying to get acquainted with you. It was a surprise to some to see you t selected in the third round. I know you had some injuries that set you back your rookie year. But uh, they're working at corner right now. Is that set in stone that cornerback is going to be your spot? Or are they still tinkering with some ideas that you might play some safety as well? Uh, well, I mean, seeing how last year went, you know, we kind of had a lot of injuries. So, um, uh, I mean, I think they're just kind of keeping me on the back burner. I mean, as of right now, corner is going to be my position. But um, they're still trying to be like, hey, if you ever get a chance to go over some safety stuff, you know, just in case something happens, we can move you back there. You can always be our, we can put this guy anywhere type guy, you know. So, yeah, to, uh, knowing that I don't have to really study the playbook like I did last year, it gives me an opportunity to go around and study some other positions. So, uh, yeah, I mean, whatever they, whatever they want me to play, you know, that's what I'm going to end up playing at the end of the day, whatever can help the team win. So, that's pretty much how I feel about it. Is that great comfort to you knowing that even though the season didn't turn out for you the way you wanted it last year, you had your head in the playbook and you're that much farther ahead of the game this year knowing what's expected of you? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It, may, it makes me feel a lot more comfortable. Um, takes a little bit more pressure off of me. Um, I can actually really focus on my game more than uh, the, the playbook, mm -hmm. you know. So um, last year I really just wanted to be in the right spot and um, just make sure I was doing my assignment. Now I can kind of move around mm -hmm. and like try to disguise or you know add the little extra stuff you know that the savvy vets like Brandon Flowers and Jason you know can add to their game to try to confuse some of the quarterbacks. So. We've talked to Casey Hayward uh, also Stevie Williams stopped on by what kind of competition is going on right now at that cornerback spot? Oh man the competition is crazy right now um, we definitely have some young guys coming in like just trying to make us say that they can play too you know so um, <laughs> yeah man Milo's a great coach man and he's all coaching us up like all of, we're all the stars so, um, yeah, it's just a really good competition going on. But at the same time, we all love each other in the room, man. Uh, we've, we've been doing a lot of bonding, you know, over this uh, off season and uh, coming into training camp. So um, I feel really good about the group. And, um, yeah, I feel like all the guys are confident, you know, that they can be the guy. So, yeah, it's a real big competition, you know. But uh, you just got to keep trying to get better every day. I can't remember. Was it Williams or Hayward that we uh, asked them to name all the cornerbacks in training camp? It was it was Casey Hayward. Yeah, Casey Hayward, the new guy. Do you feel like you're good on that right now yeah yeah yeah, yeah. even like though the new guy that was the guy that held him up the latest guy to jump in yeah 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 for what, sure you, you, uh, what, you, what's his name the latest guy number the, 40 number 40 yeah. oh Carrington there oh you go. look at you of course the Texas Times right <laughs> yeah, and he yeah, went to yeah, UT yeah, and yeah, your Texas to State all right yeah, well, the, yeah. I'm gonna give it to you right there 